And bows. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Jennifer of Custom Chic and if you're new here, let me be the first to welcome you. My channel focuses on fashion, travel, and just overall lifestyle. So if that is the kind of content you were into, then I would encourage you to subscribe, share, like, definitely hit that bell notification so you won't miss an upload. I upload videos every Wednesday and every Sunday and on today's edition is the much waited, much anticipated, not disputed. I was trying to sound like it was a boxing match. It's a Zara haul, y'all. Of course, you can't let summer go by without shopping the Zara sale. I've actually shopped it three times. So this is a culmination of everything that I have gotten thus far in summer 2021. If you don't do so already, make sure you follow me on Instagram. My handle is customs underscore chic. And let's get into these earrings. Come on. Should I do it again? Yes. I mean, I featured these in my last video which was an unboxing luxury unboxing summer 2021 and these are now my new favorite earrings I wore black because all of the other accessories in my closet have rested in peace okay these are Loewe <laughs> these are the best um I haven't actually worn them out yet because I'm still waiting on a special occasion but I thought what a better way to debut them than with y'all because I love y'all. So let's get into the video. Okay, so I've actually changed vantage points. You guys typically see me on the other side of this. So I am on the, what, right hand, my right, your left side of my little studio. And this is where all my accessories are. So they are rested in peace right now. <laughs> Again, because of these Loewe earrings. So we're not going to really do too much with them. And I'm trying to stay in the light because my camera's doing something really weird, really funky. And I'm not exactly sure what it is. But Anyway, I got all the energy in the world today. It is a weeknight. I usually don't shoot on weeknights, but we gonna get this done, okay? Um, I am wearing a black suit romper situation from H&M, and I am absolutely in love with this. By the time this video comes out, well, no, by the time this video comes out, the post on Instagram ain't gonna be live. So I'm just gonna, you know, give y'all a little sneak peek, a little decollete, if you will. All right. Zara Summer Spring Sale 2021. I didn't really shop. That's not true. I shopped it. <laughs> I shopped it in New York City. I shopped it in Miami. No, I wanted to and then I shopped it in Orlando twice. Um, I think I have a combination of probably like 15 to 20 items. I'm not really sure that that's accurate. Um, so let's get going. I'm not pulling these out in any special order of preference or anything like that. I actually did the try on a couple of weeks ago when I had these on. I just didn't have the time to actually shoot the content. So here we are. So I don't know what it is. I am 5'8 on my driver's license. And every time I shoot content or shoot videos, I feel like I need to be extremely taller. Um, so I just literally put on my <laughs> Jessica Simpson 5 inch Raffia Lucite clear um, heels just to talk to y'all. It doesn't go with the outfit at all, but I needed some length. So here we are. Okay, so first item up on the list is this beautiful gingham jumpsuit. Y'all, this is a size medium and the size run is actually small, medium, and large. And I bought this for $22.99 and it was the only one left when I was there. And I was like, oh, your girl's got to have it. Actually, you know what? I'm going to step back down because it's too much. <laughs> it's too much. There you go. See, this is my normal height. Um, $22.99 and I absolutely fell in love with this, but it was the last one. So I got this one in the Orlando Zara and I'm hopefully showing a video of myself trying it on as I'm talking about this. And... Um, she fit everywhere but right here in the bust area so it actually buttons up if you guys can see this um, so I loved it so much I really didn't want to get rid of it so what I did is I just ended up wearing it as a pair of pants and I put on my Loewe belt I wore it to brunch and it was a hit when I was finding the links for this for my reel that I posted on Instagram customs underscore chic if you don't follow me I actually ended up following finding the same exact ones at Shein when I say the same exact one, it was like the same exact color, gingham, romper, slash jumper, whatever you want to call it, at the same price point. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know who cheated first. I don't know if it was Zara or if it was Shein, but, you know, it. I, you know when you were in the high school or in, you know, school, people be like, you don't know who cheated off of who because the answers are just exactly the same. 
this is that same case in point. I don't know if it was Zara. I don't know if it was Shein. But if you're interested in this, Zara doesn't have it anymore. But you can find it on Shein and I will put it down in the description box. Second item that I want to show you guys is just this super cute natural um, romper. Again from Zara. This was also $22.99. I purchased this one in a size medium. And this one also has the kind of issue closing at the bust. But I have figured that I can probably wear this with a crop top inside or maybe even a tank top and leave a couple buttons open. Um, it does have a cinch option here in the middle with a drawstring belt. Hopefully I'm also showing you guys as I'm trying this on. I wore this flying back home from New York City literally like two or three days ago and it was super comfortable even though it's light. Um, it kept me warm on the plane. I like that it's breathable. It is 100% cotton. Actually, that's not true. It's polyester and cotton. On the bottom, I love that it has this kind of like strap detailing around the ankle. And then there are cargo pockets throughout the actual romper. So that's always, always fun. Um, Tortoiseshell-esque um, button detailing here. Hopefully you guys can see see that okay if you do that fine yeah there you go um so actually really comfortable i like these you could probably dress these up and down i initially planned to dress them up but i ended up not going anywhere super do well that's not true the restaurant we went to was kind of fancy but it wasn't a super dress up night for me so i i opted to just um wear these with sneakers so 22.99 if it's still available i'll go ahead and put it down there and i like these because they're light enough that they can actually transition into fall i know we are getting away from summer that's why all these sales are happening but honestly you can probably get wear this with a super thin turtleneck or something over over it um, or a blouse underneath it. So this is a good item if you're not necessarily sure you're gonna wear it all throughout summer and summer is coming to a close, but it, this is a good transitioning piece for fall. Third item from Zara that I'm gonna show you guys and this is gonna get washed out because the top of this dress is all white. I have actually already worn this piece. I wore this traveling to New York City. Unfortunately, I did not grab any content with this on, but it's super, super cute. I'm trying it on for you guys. So it is a dress that has an open, um, like a pop out or a cut out in the middle. And then the stripe, um, the stripe detailing. This was a size medium, I wanna say. And I was a little skeptical because the buttons were doing a little bit of pulling like around my thigh area, but there is stretch in it. So that's the way it's supposed to fit because I feel like if I would have went up to a large, besides the fact that they ain't have it in the store, <laughs> Um, it probably would not have fit me the way I would want it to. So this gives me a lot more shape. You know, it just hugs my curves just right where I want them to. So I was super comfortable with this. The only thing that's annoying is that I hate these things. And I don't like to cut them because you never know if you have to like switch up your closet. If you got to wear it, you know, if you got to fold it, if you got to hang it. Um, but it's okay. So the back of this is just one piece. So it is an entire one piece. But when you wear it right there, there is that cutout in the middle um long sleeve that are kind of like boyfriend-esque sorry because i'm moving around my camera trying to find the lighting um that are kind of like boyfriend-esque but they're very easy to um roll up the sleeve so you can do that if you want to what i also noticed is that i didn't have time to iron this when i left the house but it still wears well even though it was not ironed so if you're interested in this i want to say it was like 17 or 12.99 if i can still find it i would put it down in the description box so I've been seeing crochet dresses a lot lately. Y'all know me. I know I love colors. So I picked up this crochet sleeveless. Um, it's not a tunic dress. It's just a regular dress from Zara. And it was actually $22.99. I love it. Super, super comfortable. Um, by the time this video comes out, I think I should have already posted the picture of me in Dumbo um, with this dress just kind of chilling out. Just, you know, you know. Scoping the scene, <laughs> scoping the scene. Super comfortable. Um, it is crochet and I know y'all are thinking why are you wearing that thick knit sweater dress in the summertime? But honestly, because it's sleeveless, it definitely gave me room to breathe. This is a size medium, I don't think I said that. I can't recall what the size run is on this particular one because I've already worn it and ripped the tag. Um, it did hug my curves where I wanted it to around my hip area, but I think it was a little bit too loose around my waist. If I can, I'm going to try to take it to my tailor and see what she can do. But honestly, this is, it's, it's like crochet, right? So it's like, you don't really want to mess with it. But if your tailor knows what they're doing, you don't got to worry about nothing. You don't, you really don't up some like crop top pieces i've been experimenting with that especially in 2021 with zara um because no other brand really gives me the opportunity to actually fit into their crop top so i'm just trying to get a, like 
a feel and a love for what works for me, especially y'all I'm busty. I mention it in every single video that I do. So if you're new here, welcome. <laughs> I'm always going to talk these up, not in the way that um, I'm self-conscious about them, but I'm always conscious about them when I'm getting dressed um, because I never want them to be the focus of my outfit. They're already there. They're not going anywhere. So I just don't need them to be like, hey, va va boom, hello. Like, you know, yes, I have curves, but the point of the story or the moral of the story is I try to dress them down as often as I can. So next up, I picked up this like half sweater situation. I know y'all are looking at me like, what is this? I didn't even want to try it on because I don't want to mess it up with makeup. I got it in a size large and it's a $12.99. And this is perfect for those of us who get cold. Okay. Think tank top. Think a midi slip dress, think a bralette, think a crop top. And if you don't really want to show all of that skin and you kind of want to, you know, cover up, this is your perfect thing. It's super cool because it's just one sided. The sleeve is on one side. I don't know if it came in any more colors. I think this was actually part of a set. So it had a bottom to it. I try to find the bottom in my size no avail obviously this is a sale you kind of get what you can while you're shopping um i really wish that i was able to get this but unfortunately i wasn't i was no i wasn't able to get the bottom this i got <laughs> it's in my hand right um but i did not try this on for y'all because again i didn't want to put any makeup or get any makeup on it but again like i said i am envisioning this super easy with a spaghetti strap um midi dress slip dress putting this over me um on a chilly summer night depending on where i am or very very easily transition into fall in that same vein i picked up one of these crop tops it is a v-neck y'all can see that <laughs> it is a v-neck crop top this material is actually very much like sweat pant jersey like i'm gonna try to pan out there you go so that you guys can see it this was also 12.99 size run a small medium and large I got this in a medium um and it fits me really well it actually I could have gone up to a large but I felt like my breasts would have been falling underneath it because this doesn't really strap or hold anybody in but I felt like with my bra either a strapless bra or a very thin um strapped bra I could wear this and then still feel secure right like I felt like it was gonna hold the girls down here the large I feel like things were just would have been slipping out and I have too much boob to be trying it, like it, for me it's not going to translate into side or under boob it'll just be titty <laughs> so uh, you know if that's you cool but that's just you know that's not my ministry so um I got this they are available I think in a variety of different colors but I was happy to have picked this up in a size medium last one I think y'all have already seen this if not this is my second time picking up a um like jersey knit kind of just regular cotton um crop top from Zara I actually paired this crop top with the yellow and cream gingham romper that I initially showed you guys and that Loewe belt at brunch it was a hit I'll pop up a picture if you guys didn't see it but this was $5.99 um this is a size small so for all of you who are interested and maybe heavier busted think about that because it has a lot and I mean a lot of stretch to it like if I can wear a size small in a crop top in Zara um, that is very telling as to how just expansive <laughs> or, you know, the amount of spandex that it has. I will say to you, I do honestly believe that it's because it's got this super thick, let me, okay, there we go. So you see at the bottom where it has that super thick band of just elastane or elast elastic, that is exactly what has allowed me to wear a medium or rather a small in this crop top so shout out to all you people at zara please make more tops like this big busted girls like me are ready is that a hole no it's not okay there's a button there there's a slit it's intentional i was like come on h m that's why we doing a zara haul the last three pieces that i want to talk about are these and i don't know what happened i honestly don't i don't know if i was on a pink frenzy initially i was initially i was i was looking for something to wear to one of my friends surprise bridal shower and the theme was rose and i hadn't found anything and i kept saying to myself like you need to find something pink you need to find something pink but in my head i'm thinking no rose is more like blush rose is more like blush so i found two or three things and i was just like i don't know i don't know if i'm gonna uh, uh, uh. anyway y'all i found this beautiful sleeveless like pleated romper jumpsuit baby <laughs> oh oh i mean 
it is so simple. It's so simple, but she's beautiful. Like, can y'all see these pleats? Look at that. Um, it's not open back. It just happened to be that way. It's a, um, it's a non-exposed zipper closure. It looks red in the camera right now, but I assure you it is a smoking, piping, hot fuchsia, hot pink. It was on sale for $25.90. I got it in the size large. The size run is a small, medium, and large. It fits really well. It... It kind of like grazes the body, so it's very chic. It's very kind of like ethereal. Now, I think I am going to have the waist brought in just a little bit, but if I don't want to, it does have a very skinny belt detail that I can use with this. But I'm gonna go extra, and I'll probably pair this with a Loewe belt or another belt, maybe a thinner or maybe, um, oh gosh, this would be so pretty with a thick belt. Not necessarily the Loewe one, but just like a thick banded belt all around. Um, and I am a taller girl and when I say that this leaves room, it's kind of like dragging on the floor. I love that. I, for me, I love that. It, it's, I have heels on and it's still dragging. Like, I just love to see the <laughs> length of a woman, if you understand what I'm saying, right? If she's wearing a piece, I just love to see how that flows and just watch a movement, a woman's movement. Um, the movement of a woman. Wow. It, listen, I've already worked or built 10 hours, so that means I worked more than 10 hours today, so excuse me. I always think and I always make excuses that I'm tired, I'm just excited, but I just talk too fast. I just talk, <laughs> sometimes I just talk too fast and it just comes out way too fast and then, you know, and then I'm doing this. I'm apologizing to y'all because what I'm saying don't make no sense. All right, come on, let's go. This is a Wednesday video, so we got to make it succinct, concise, and, you know, whatever that other word is. So, um, $25.90. It doesn't have pockets, unfortunately, but I don't mind that because I think this is just so... You can see through this. Like, I can, I can see the camera through this. Um, so, be careful about that when choosing undergarments. Um, I didn't even realize that. It was made in Morocco, and it's a large. That's probably why I fit, so... But thank you, Zara. Bag. Okay, next one is this. This one is kind of complicated, but when I saw it on the hanger, it was just beautiful. So it is this. I can't even tell you what it is. Let me tell you how much it costs first. So this on sale was fifty nine ninety, and I fell in love with it again because of what it was. It's this beautiful dress, and it's kind of got like this Peter Pan <laughs> um, cape situation in the back. But it falls at such an awkward, awkward length on me. Like, if it grazed the floor or even just grazed, like, below my ankle, I would have been really happy with it. But I'm showing you guys right now as I'm talking. It just falls at a really weird length. Like, I like the way it grazes my body. Also, um, this is a size medium. But for $60, I know that that's not super expensive. But I can get something that fits a little bit better. I'm trying to figure out how I can still rock with this without having to bring it back but honestly like i'm just sad i'm sad about it i really needed this to i like this was going to be my ethereal moment like i'm going to cancun in a couple weeks and i just i needed this this ain't given what y'all said it was supposed to have gave that's it <laughs> at the end of the day that that's just it so i don't know what do y'all think should i keep it or should i return it give it a try what what should i do with this what does thou say so some of y'all, I don't know if any of you know this, but I am obsessed with Hanifa, the um, Congolese designer. She was the first one, yes, who broke all of Al Gore's internets, okay, in 2020 and did the first ever virtual fashion show. She has a beautiful collection. She's Congolese again, like I said. All of her collections are beautiful, but there is one in particular that has this super long, sweeping duster cardigan. And it comes in a yellow, it comes in a green, and it comes in a purple. And it's not inexpensive, right? I, I think I've said this many a times when I do these videos. All of that price is relative, especially depending on who you're talking to. Anyway, I bring all that up to say I found this pink sweater dress. Um, same kind of, to me, same kind of idea, except this is a complete sweater dress and it's not a cardigan and it doesn't have like these, you know, nice little tassels running down the floor of it and it doesn't have a um, strap in the middle, but it's the same concept. And it was $35.99 and the size run is small, medium, and large. And I thought to myself, you know what? I actually kind of like this. You know, I wore it with my Loewe belt and it worked, or at least I tried it on with my Loewe belt. And I was like, I don't mind this. I don't hate this. So, 
I don't know, I think I'm gonna keep it. If anything, I'm thinking love boot in the winter time, or I'm thinking sneakers in the fall, like some really cute white regular sneakers. Um, so I will see what we're gonna do with this because I don't I don't hate it. Um, but I don't know if I want to stay in the back yet. So what do y'all say? What thou sayest about the second pink piece? All right. So these are the pants that I thought were going to go with my half sleeve situation. Same material. Well, maybe not same material, but very very close, very very close colorway. Um, it just did not fit. This, these were a size medium. They were on sale for $25.90. I actually really like them because they are sweat pant material. Can you guys see that? There you go. And um, they have a nice slit in the front. And they seemed like they were going to be the nice height or a nice height that I would have liked. But these bad boys just don't fit. And, you know, that's, that's just that. I was excited. Again, crop tops, Zara. They're giving me what I need this season. Mmm. $22.99 this comes in a size run of extra small to extra large um, and I thought I was going to get away with this because of that elastane there at the bottom and then it had um, straps that I can kind of tie around in the back maybe billowy sleeves maybe we can call it that no she said no girl go home she said go home <laughs> or take me back to Zara because she came home and it, it didn't work it was enough and last but certainly not least, I picked up a pair of trousers. I realize that I buy a lot of bottoms, but I don't buy a lot of tops. And sometimes I don't really shop with a certain look in my head. I just buy what I like and then I kind of put all those things together. But um, these pants, they were very short, even though they looked like they were going to be long. The sale, $22.99. It went from a size run from extra small to double XL so I thought oh girl you are gonna win with this medium absolutely not it fit around the waist but when I tell you it just came to like a really really weird stopping point um it wasn't it that wasn't it so that is it I think that was about 15 to 20 pieces that's all I got <laughs> From Zara so no matter what number it was that's all I got I appreciate y'all so much for watching if you stuck around this long you know what to do love these Loewe earrings if you do drop something down um, in the comment box and let me know if you love them or if you hate them let me know what you love or hate remember two pieces that I need your help on determining whether I'm going to keep or send back is the fuchsia pieces so it's that cape situation and then the sweater dress that I feel like is inspired by Hanifa official and I think that's it, y'all. Um, if you stuck around this long, you know what to do. Make sure to like, share, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you will not miss an upload. I upload every Wednesday and every Sunday, and I will see y'all next time. Also, I'm so sorry about not having a video on Sunday. My schedule has been crazy, but I'm getting better. I'm going to be more consistent, and I'm going to start pre-recording so I don't have an excuse to not talk to y'all because I miss y'all when I don't post, and I hope y'all miss me when I don't post. And this is a Wednesday video that has now probably gone over 20 minutes, so I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.